Hi, this is Sherry Veronica. Um, we've been hearing a whole lot about the background of Neil Rose family and the makeup and you know what they do and what they don't do and what their proclivities are. Yeah, you've been hearing a lot. I've been hearing a lot about Neil Rowe. Here he is. He's a member of parliament. He probably was well liked by Mia Motley to have been picked by Mia Motley to be one of her merry men. But um, he has gone into a lot of trouble since he has been elected. Okay, so what about the mother? What about Tonil's mother? You're not hearing much about her, but they say her name is Latoya Archer. And she's a senior foreign service officer with the ministry of foreign affairs and she's on the short term she, presently now she's on a short term assignment with the office of permanent representative to the un but where is she what does she look like you know like it's the holiday season now and when you're off and you're back home and then you go back into the office and people say well how will, how was your holiday season how are the kids how is everything what is latoya going to say Many people are asking her, how is the family? How was your Christmas holiday season? What is LaToya going to say? Um, uh, um, there was a hiccup and, you know, my, 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 they got their diplomatic passport, you know, hell, it was taken away and they are not happy, created a big stick. You cannot search me. I am a diplomat. I travel on a diplomatic passport. Put all that shit back in my suitcase and close it and pretend you didn't see it. But it didn't work. So, you know, sometimes when the government is in power, you would think that the officers or the police association would probably give certain, like, breaks or whatever, say, ah, oh, we don't want to do this. We don't want to embarrass our prime minister. You know, let's put this one, you know, we're going to give her a little slap on the wrist, but let's let's keep this one on the down low. They didn't. They didn't. So that means that even when Mia Motley back in the day, <laughs> this is what I've heard. Mia Motley back in the day can show up where officers are and say, get lost, <laughs> get lost. And they get into their into their SUVs and just pull off. She was the boss. She would tell them, get lost. So what has happened? What has happened? This is 2024 now, that happened in 2023. But what has happened with Mia Motley and her her power? But anyhow, what we were talking about? We were talking about LaToya. When LaToya goes back to work, and I would like a photo, please, of LaToya Archer. You talk about Barbie the Swan. I would like a photo of Latoya Archer and not only that anyone that is working for you any silver servant or anyone who's being paid by taxpayers money there should be photos of them the, the, the whole lineup of who's working for the government should be online we should know we should be able to go online and pull up a a person who's working for the government with their photo, their day, the birth, everything. It should be how much they're being paid. All of that. You talk about transparency. All of that should be part of your search and, and something that is ascertainable and easily ascertainable. Okay. So um, we don't know what Latoya looks like. They sent me a whole lot of photos, but I don't believe what they're sending me. So I'm not putting it up. They say, yes, this is her. I know her well. No, you no, no, bitch. You don't know her well. You're just trying to act. You know, you know someone that has a diplomatic past, but you don't know Latoya well. So I didn't. I'm not going to put it up. <laughs> I'm gonna put it up. But anyhow, if you have a photo of Latoya Archer, and and she's seen with the prime minister or or in some sort of you know setting where you can see her name is mentioned, that's the only way I'm gonna believe it. Please send it to me. But it seems as though I'm go I'm saying I have something. Else. It seems as though she's the one who blew the whistle. Latoya came into Barbados, you know, it's vacation and it's the holidays and whatever. And she was supposed to see Tonil and where Tonil said they were going to be, they weren't. And it seems as though Latoya is the one that sounded the alarm and that's how 
they knew she was off the island and and whatever whatever you you, you know the, you know the ending of that story but um latoya archer we need to know what she looks like she's she's working for the government in the foreign service as a foreign service officer there should be photos of she's mentioned at times in you know barbie this minister of foreign affairs she's mentioned at times but no photo of her and they i don't know what they are doing right now i don't know what the father he's doing right now but um we would like a photo we will i would like a photo of latoya archer tonil rose mother because the father has been dragged he's a member of parliament he's a civil servant he's a uh, uh, he's a uh, personality. He's a personality. I won't know if he. I won't say that he's a, a celebrity, but he's a, a a personality in Barbados, well known. And we can talk about people who are being paid on taxpayers' money and who are well known, who are part of government, like he is. You know. So uh, we would like to know what she looks like now. What Latoya Archer looks like now. And did she have other children for Row, or was it only? They, I don't know, but um, this is it. That's it. Be sure, Veronica.